Ahmed, what's the title of our experience or of our lesson today? And what can we now do, Anton? I can find probability of Good. So we are now able to find the probability of both. Um, definitions are given to you. I'm going to skip over those. Two really key formulas that you must know. This baby right here, even in your notes, if I were you, I would highlight it somehow. Probability of independent events would be the fundamental kind of principle, whatever A is times whatever B is. Okay? A does not impact B. A couple of examples given to you. We got a little tricky here on letter C. So make sure you pay attention to letter C because it is asking you um, a little bit of a different question in the first two. Um, and then I'm going to slide down to dependent events. Again, super duper important that you know that the probability of A and B on dependent events would be whatever your outcome is here times your outcome here after event A takes place. Really, 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 really super important. I almost can stop the video, and I'm going to stop the video in a couple seconds here um, after that, but really if you just think about what you're calculating with independent and dependent events and you know your formulas, there shouldn't be much of a struggle when it comes to this assignment and it comes to calculating these probabilities. Uh, the biggest problem, I think, in the whole thing was letter B here in the dependent event area. Probability of getting two consonants or two vowels. We calculated the probability of drawing two consonants from the phrase math rules at 5 twelfths, and we calculated the probability of drawing two vowels from the phrase math rules. And we added them all together, which was the big question, do you add them or multiply them? But it really doesn't make sense to do anything but add those probabilities together to get out of a, a one over every two probability. Anything that you want to add or any questions? Know the formula for calculating dependent events. Know the formula for calculating independent events. Get it stuck in your brain.